Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel. Um, today is Thursday and today is the day my husband has off tonight. On Thursdays and Sundays my husband has... Um, so today we can, I kind of just have half of a work day and then the rest of the day is like a family day. So I'll be doing some work today. I have to do some organizing of like my studio and just do some work for my family's business. Um, today, she actually has swim class today, so I'll take you guys along to see that. Um, we also need to go to the store to get her clothes because I don't think I mentioned this, but Ruby is gonna be six months on the 9th, but she is a lot bigger than the average six month old. Um, she's like completely off the charts with her length, her body and her head. So, she was wearing 12, she started wearing 12 months when she was like four months old. So now she's like completely grown out of that. And she's at this point, she's an 18 month. So today my husband and I need to go to the store and go get some clothes for her because she's literally growing out of everything. She does not fit into anything at all, at all. Actually, I just got some new toys in from Amazon for her. I try to do a lot of like independent play for her, so I do have a lot of like Montessori toys for her. Um, but I just got this new toy, which I thought was super cute, so I'll show you. Hello. Hi. What are you doing? <laughs> yeah, her hair is super long. She's always had really long hair since she was born. Um, but like, it's getting to the point where like I literally try brushing it and putting water in it. I don't know if there's like baby products I can put into her hair to kind of like tame it a little bit, but it just doesn't go down. So I kind of just like put a giant bow on there so you don't see what's going on back there. But yeah, anyway, I have, I bought these little like um, wooden rings and they have these kind of like, um, they have this ribbon attached to it and it has these little bells. So she kind of just holds on to them and goes crazy with it. She's been loving it so far. I also did get her this, like, little water mat, um, just because when I'm, like, going to feed her, hi, just when I'm going to feed her, like, on the high chair, um, so she has something to kind of keep her entertained while she's waiting for me to get her food ready for her, but yeah, it's just cute, I think it's just, like, $10, and I'm pretty sure these are, like, $10, too, so, not super expensive, they're still really cute. finally got Ruby on for a nap but she is not feeling her best right now I'm not sure if it's like allergies I know she's not she doesn't have a cold or anything but like this morning she kind of woke up and her eyes were a little bit boogery and her nose was a little bit runny and her cheeks are red but she doesn't have a fever and she's not coughing or anything so I know she's not like actually sick I just think it's allergies so um we're hoping that's it but we do have a doctor's appointment so um unfortunately my baby's not feeling very good so i'm hoping she feels a little bit better but i finally got her down for a nap and i am going to try to organize this room so behind me i know don't look at that <laughs> but um this is kind of like where i do like pictures and i have been super busy this week um we've had so many orders and it's just been super hectic so I kind of just want to take some time to kind of organize and I had some new arrivals come in and I also have I think I'm also gonna do an Instagram sale um, like an Instagram live sale or like maybe a story sale so I do need to figure out what I'm gonna be doing for that sale I need to figure out uh, my new arrivals kind of um, just get the stock into my website and have it ready to go for Monday. Usually Monday they do my drops. And then also just like organize Ruby's toys. She is in this room with me like 90% of the time except for when she's sleeping. So I do have a lot of her toys in here and I keep them in here just for her to be entertained and have some independent play. But um, yeah, so I do need to do that. <laughs> Okay, and 
and here's the finished product so um i did take a lot of the stuff out of the packaging it comes in except for like that stuff over here um just because it's sherpa and when it comes out of the packaging it does expand a little bit so it's easier to keep that in packaging but um but a lot of this stuff we have um i did just get a couple of um, new arrivals that i did unpack so all of the stuff that you see has a lot of it those are new arrivals um but like you can see on the bottom like down here like we just have a few things that we only have one or two things of um so i think i am gonna do like a story sale on instagram um just to get rid of that kind of stuff but yeah i feel so much better about this so we did end up deciding to not take her to swim class tonight just because she's not feeling herself and we want her to enjoy the class every time she goes um so and plus we can take her anytime during the week so we might just take her sunday but i want to show you guys this super cute swimsuit my mom got her i love it it has these oh i thought you threw off it has these high-waisted bottoms so cute and then look how adorable this top is it is like a little tube top and then it has like these little ties on the side of it and then it has this cute little bow but it's a little tight the bow is just a little bit tight so i might just cut it and then try to put it on her but this girl's crazy hair i don't know we'll see it might a lot of stuff tangles in her hair so we'll see we're now at h&m um we were gonna go to target but last time i was in there there wasn't a whole lot of stuff so do you like this one instead hey or this, that other pink one? The first one? Yeah, this one. Will you hold it, actually? Will you hold these and put the other one back? Um, yeah, I don't know. The last couple times I was at Target, they had all the boy stuff. And I do, I don't mind buying her boy stuff at all. Like, a lot of her clothes are boy stuff. But it was like every time I was going there, I was getting her something that was a boy's. So, now we're at H&M. Um, and there's like nobody here, so we're just trying to find her some stuff because nothing fits her at all. They have super cute shoes here for babies, but she's never worn shoes. She's only worn socks. When did you guys start putting shoes on your babies? Because I have no idea. Am I supposed to right now? I don't know. But yeah, we got some cuties. We got cute goodies here. Okay, guys. So it is the next day, but I did want to show you guys um, what I got from each of them. We only got a few things because I didn't like love everything that was there. Um, I did end up ordering some stuff online that they didn't have in store, but this is what I picked up yesterday. So <clears throat> first thing is this cute little polka dot shirt. This is in 18 months and it was only $5. So I thought it was super cute. And then the next thing I got was this little collared shirt. I really got it just for the collar, just to like layer it under a cute little sweater or something. This was only $10 and I got this in 12 months. It's cause I thought it ran a little bit big, but yeah, I got this one in 12 months. And then I did, and I went there to find like beige or tan, um, like little leggings for her, but they didn't have any in her size. They only had six months and under, but so I ended up getting these ones. These are like black and gray ones for two of them. It was only $13. So yeah, I thought that was a good deal. So I got these. And then I also got this cute little throwover sweater and i got this one in 18 months and it was ten dollars too so i think we spent a total of like 40 bucks on everything um which i thought was actually a pretty good deal we got like five things i did end up like i said i did end up ordering some stuff from amazon just because i didn't find everything that i wanted in store we actually just got in one of uh, the things i ordered here from amazon we got her this little set um, it's kind of like a mustard yellow. I think it's so cute. The only thing is it's a little bit long on her, on her arms and her legs. But 
and then the thing is that this it's not like an actual drawstring it's like just sewn on so it doesn't adjust but it's still really cute and it fits her well she got a 12 to 18 months in this and i believe it was only like 16 dollars or something but it's still really cute well thank you guys so much for watching this vlog um we hope you enjoyed it make sure to give it a thumbs up if you did and to subscribe and just let me know what you guys want to see. I have a lot of videos in mind, but I still want to know what you guys want to see. So let me know. Um, we love you guys.